Yesterday, President Cyril Ramaphosa's address to ANC supporters in Ashdown in Peter Marsburg was disrupted by a group of community health care workers. These workers, who are primarily demanding full-time employment and better compensations, used the event as an opportunity to voice their grievances directly to the president. The community health care workers currently earn a stipend of about 4,000 rands per month and lack benefits of such as pension and medical aid. They are hired on a contractual basis, typically for one-year term, leaving them without job security or long-term employment prospects. This precarious employment situation has driven them to demand a permanent position within the healthcare system. During Ramaphosa's speech, the community health workers chanted and held up placards calling for, the, for a meeting with the President Ramaphosa before May 29th, which marks the date of the upcoming elections. Their placards bore a message such as, President Ramaphosa, we need a meeting with you regarding community health care workers. And, President, can you survive on 4,000 runs per month when you are absorbing health care workers? The workers' interruption were a direct appeal for immediate action on their employment status. President Ramaphosa did not directly address the protesters' demand during his speech. Instead, he focused on the ANC's broader economic and health care plans, highlighting the NHI bill that is recently signed into law. He emphasized the bill's importance in making quality health care accessible to all South Africans, particularly the poor who currently struggle to afford medical services. Ramaphosa also spoke about the ANC's effort to create jobs through the expanded public work program, which aims to provide employment opportunities across various sectors. He reiterated the ANC's commitment to addressing economic inequalities and improving public services, but the specific concerns of the healthcare workers were not addressed in his public remarks. The disruption underscored the growing frustration among the healthcare workers and the other public sector employees in South Africa. The community health workers' protest is a part of the largest pattern of labor unrest and the demand for better working conditions and the compensations. The action at the rally highlighted the urgent need for dialogue between the government and the healthcare workers to find a sustainable solution to their employment issues. This event also reflected the broader challenges faced by the ANC as it is prepared for the upcoming elections. The party is under increasing pressure to deliver its promises of the economic reform and improved public services. The demand of the community health workers add another layer of complexity to the ANC's campaign effort as it must address both immediate labor disputes and long-term policy goals.